The former Canadian ambassador to the United States dropped by St. Jacob's today to talk about a subject many would prefer to keep silent. The Honorable Michael Wilson spoke about the importance of being open about mental illnesses and getting rid of the stigma. CTV's Matthew Kang was at the talk and has more. Matt. Abigail, the former ambassador spoke at a church in St. Jacob's and shared his own experience with the issue. With a strong voice and presence honed in the political arena, the Honorable Michael Wilson addressed a delicate subject. There remains a deadly barrier to recovery from a mental illness or an addiction. And I am speaking of a grave social injustice, the issue of stigma and discrimination. The former ambassador made it his mission to curb negative perceptions and the closeted nature surrounding mental illness ever since his son Cameron took his own life in 1995 at the age of 29. Sharing thoughts and personal experience, Wilson also praised the work of Shalom Counseling Services, who invited him as guest speaker. It's very important for these community-based organizations to reach out and support people who are suffering from mental illness or addiction. According to the Centre for Addiction and Mental Health, one in five Canadians will experience a mental illness in their lifetime, but only 50% of us would tell someone we have a family member with a mental illness, compared to 72% for cancer or 68% for diabetes. Shalom Counseling Services Executive Director says a voice like Wilson's can help turn that around. Michael Wilson's involvement here this morning was to give us that bigger picture and this is also from a man who's walked this experience in a very personal way. And Wilson says it is important to accept and deal with mental illnesses the same way we would with physical ones. That it is not any inherent weakness of character or anything like that but an illness that can be treated if properly diagnosed. And just a reminder that Mental Health Week begins nationally this Monday. Abigail